SportsNola.com visiting with Tulane defensive end Desmond Moses. And uh, Des, last week, uh, I know it's one you want to quickly put behind you, but you know, the, I guess it has to be frustrating after such a great effort against UAB to come back and not perform to your best against Duke. Right. Yeah, it's definitely tough. Um, disappointing loss, you know, especially, like you said, the way we played against UAB. Um, you know, we just didn't play our best football on Saturday, and, and that's, you know, no excuse. You can never have any excuses, but that was just the case. We need to come out and play more consistent week in and week out. You're a New Jersey native, so this week against Army, it's got to be kind of special. I know you'll have a lot of folks from home at the game, uh, probably having to, you know, get those get those tickets from some of your teammates and things like yeah. that to be able to accommodate everybody. Oh yeah, you know it's nice to go back home. You know my teammates, I don't have too many from New Jersey, so getting the tickets shouldn't be too big of a problem. But you know it'll, it'll definitely be nice to go back home. I don't know too many guys, you know, that, that go to Army, but you know my family will be in the crowd. You know, a little extra motivation for me, um, and I'm excited. Talk about the challenges that Army's offense brings. It's something totally different than you will face at any other point this year. It's a lot more assignment football as opposed to just trying to get upfield and, and get after the passer, so to speak. Yeah, you definitely. Uh, we understand what type of defense. I mean, type of offense they are. I'm sorry, um, but it's more about being disciplined. You know, if, if you can stay in your gap, you know, take care of your assignment on each and every play, and every guy does that. All 11 players. You know, our coaches has, have a great scheme for us, and we should be just fine. But you know, if you if you stray away from that, then that's when you have issues, especially with a team like them, them being so disciplined. I guess the the old 24 hour rule works both ways. After after a win or after a loss, uh, you've got Duke out of the system now and focus totally on the task at hand. Well, I'm gonna let it stay around a little bit longer because you know I wasn't too happy about our performance last week, and, and I'm gonna let that be the motivation for our work ethic this week. You know, we need to come out and work a little harder, work more consistently, um, because that's the only way you can become a better team. You can't you know have a great week one week and then play down the next week because, you know, frankly, that just doesn't win enough games. So in this in this college football league, you know, you have to play football every single week the best you can play. You know, ups and downs really, you know, that just doesn't cut it. So we understand that, and we're going to let it, you know, we're going to let it hurt a little bit. We're going to go out here and practice today, you know, to our best ability and, and extremely hard, and I'm going to push guys and make sure we do that. To our defensive end, Desmond Moses, stay with us at SportsNola.com for coverage of the Green Wave all this week.